Hi, welcome to Bookish Brits. I'm Rex, and today I'm going to be talking about Invisible Women by Caroline Credo Perez. Now, this book I think was published at the beginning of last year. I read it on an ebook, um, and I read it because a whole bunch of people I knew recommended it to me from completely different sources, and it seemed like a book I had to read. So the book is about the gender data gap, and what the author means by that is that we have data, extraordinary amounts of data, on absolutely everything. However, there is a gap in a lot of areas that are key to our daily lives where we just don't have enough data about women. And the book goes through lots of different areas, uh, pharmaceuticals, transport, um, how cities are planned, and gives examples of how we have missing data essentially on women and how when we have that data it dramatically changes how we then execute those things. So you'd probably be terrified to learn that a huge amount of medicines that were invented or discovered or whatever the right term is before uh, quite recently and even still today are not tested on women before they hit the market and this is because women's bodies are too unpredictable so it's easier to test them on men then release them um, and then find out what the results are after the fact which seems crazy I mean the whole chapter has me aghast and terrified and almost every single chapter in the book is like that you spend most of it going I had no idea that this was happening um, crash test dummies all sorts of things that you just wouldn't guess. And as soon as I read it, I then recommended it to tons of people who have then recommended it to tons of people. It is one of those things that is eminently readable. Like the second you pick it up, her language is very accessible. I know with nonfiction, a lot of people are very uh, put off by nonfiction and it can be it can be quite hard going. It can be quite hard to get into. But usually when I read nonfiction, I read one chapter of nonfiction and about three chapters of fiction. Um, but with this, I could not put it down. Um, I read it twice in a row. That's that's how into it I got. Um, and every single person I know, male and female, who have read it, have also had a similar uh, reaction of just shock and um, complete awe at how well it well written the book was and how interesting it is. So. Um, it doesn't matter who you are, you need to read this book. It will change how you look at everything. 